Konnichiwa. Hello. Whoa. Wait. Why is that dark? Huh? Give me, give me one second. What? Oh boy, but hello, how's everyone? Give me, give me a second. What is, what is happening? Life, life is happening, that's what it is. Ya broke it. I break a lot of things. Okay, there we go. Hey, that wasn't so bad. Oh no, now it's not moving. Oh, okay, it's moving. Nice. <sighs> you almost died. Oh, don't be dramatic. But yes, hello, how's everyone? You having a great time? Dark mode. Why not try light mode? Try light mode for once. Hmm. Good. How are you? I'm great. I'm drinking tea. Ah, <sighs> I cried every day while you were gone. I wasn't gone. Because, you see, I had quite a lot of fun at Anime Boston. It was a great time. And, oh, wait. By the way, how are my expressions? Aren't they on point today? They've always been on point, but look at that. These eyebrows, man.
<laughs> They're always on point. Yeah, thank you. But are they? They are. Uh, but let's see. Oh, do you guys want to hear bits as to what happened? Can't tell you the full details, but uh, there were uh, a lot of people uh, who attended the panel, and I was really surprised. And uh, needless to say, I was quite anxious uh, seeing how there were uh, quite a lot of people, and I thank you for that. How many? Uh, did you gaslight the cronies at Boston? Just once. Were there any cute ladies? Yes. Um, Fauna? Of course, me. Ollie and Rainy. That's right. Just once. Yeah, just once. Were the cute ladies single? Like... Like us? Because we are... We are single, but... Not ready to mingle, if that's what you're saying. Sorry, I'm taken by none other than a beautiful crony. That's right. Did they morb in Boston? What is that even supposed to mean? Okay, but anyway. Yeah, it was... It was a lot of fun. We did uh, spin the wheel. And... Uh... Call, called some people out, uh, some willing volunteers, and it, that was a lot of fun. And then the meet and greet. Oh boy. I was really nervous in the beginning. Uh, but it was, it was really nice at the end of the day. And it, it's crazy. It's crazy to interact with people face to face and oh man. Keki Tine. Oh, hey! Keki Tine! Yeah! I remember you. And your cosplay was on point. I remember that. I hear that you look even cuter in person. Is that true? You mean cooler. How many people did they let you talk to? Around 20, I think? And... Yeah, there were about... Yeah, 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 20 people. And... Staff was asking if I wanted to take a break. Uh, since... I... I was talking about how nervous I was, but I said no, because that means I get to interact with people less. So, I tried to use up my time as much as possible with the people that I met up with. And... Yeah, that was nice. Mm. Oh, man. Neck. Did I go over time? Probably? But... I think I was the last person. Uh, so... I didn't take anyone's time, fortunately. So, you missed those neck cracks. Ha ha ha. Thank you. Uh, I miss them too. It's probably bad for me. I'm gonna be hospitalized, but that's okay. Cause that is living, and life is living. You are too good for us. Oh, I know. <laughs> But as long as you guys are aware, that's all that matters. We'll miss you again. <laughs> uh, well, anyway, you see guys, today is tea time. So, 
you guys, uh, bring your own personal poison to the stream? Well, for me, I am drinking barley tea, however... I am going to combine chamomile. That was not me. That was the tea. And I am dropping it in. There we go. Actually, barley tea and chamomile, it's not so bad. Are you doing alchemy? If you guys feel like experimenting, go for it. I saw that some of you were having milk, so why not... ...combine milk with... ...let's say, kombucha. Try it. Mm-mm, good. Heard a hot sauce goes well with barley tea? You should try that. Mmm. Or... Or you could have... Water with hot sauce. Hey, that might be nice. What if I die? You're not gonna die from that. They're all edible. Uh, let's see... Do, 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 do. Uh, but thank you to Park Yonggi. Um, uh, give me, give me, give me a second. Give me one second. Okay. But I just wanted to thank. Uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. I use uh I use a plugin where I can see uh people who sent in the supers, but lately it hasn't been working. I was fixing it, I was trying to fix it today and yesterday didn't work out, so I just said screw it. And I didn't. So whatever. Uh but thank you to number 1729. Uh so glad you hide. A fun and sweet time at uh, Anime Boston, and hope the cronies make good memories there. Yeah, I, I met, I met quite a few number of people uh, who I thought was amazing. Like, let's see, I I'm thinking. Uh, there were like five cronies at the front in the panel, which was crazy. And they were, they were dripped. Damn. With their, with their, with their suits and everything. It's amazing. Five or six cronies at the front of the panel, so. The crony drip. And, uh... One of the people, uh... That I was talking to during the meet and greet said... It was incredibly hot while wearing the suit, so... Props to that. Sweating, but in style. <laughs> uh, and thank you to Martin. Uh... I'm back. Miss you. Miss all of you. Have a nice day and night, everyone. Thank you, Martin. And Croquette. Uh, Crony, I did try to hold back, but after the convention, I can't take it anymore. Unironically, come to Brazil. Brazil. It's not in my power to do that, but maybe, maybe one day. Park Hyunggi. Hope you enjoyed Boston, Anime Boston. Really wanted to go. Uh, 
the end of the May, you've achieved many milestones, 720,000 subscribers, and Daydream hit, uh, hit 1.1 million views. I wish not only you, but also council members continuing to grow. I guess your ice cream truck is right next to it. Oh, thank you. Uh, were there girl fans? Female cronies, of course! It's... It's cute. It was cute. And great cosplayers, too. One was uh, dressed up as Mume. And man, that cosplay was on point. So, when we were taking pictures together, I was saying how. Oh, OMG, Kron May. <laughs> That was really good. Ah. Uh. Oh, and I realized that I I realized after the panel, uh there was there was also one person uh who said, "Oh, Crony is my Oshi." Uh towards the end. And I realized that I recognized that person. So Yeah, I, I've been I've been saying the name wrong this entire time. <laughs> People have you as their Oshi, really? I know, crazy. Why? But that was funny. Oh, was it on purpose? Oh, have I been saying it correctly then? You're my Oshi. Oh, thank you. Tihi. Oh, thank you, Albo Heel. Oh, the two Brandons. Oh god. Oh god. That that makes me remember. I was kind of beating myself up after. I was I was really I was really nervous. I don't know if people could tell. Probably not. Because my acting is so on point. <laughs> but yeah. The the two Brandons, I think I said the name wrong. Um, for the second person, I think I misheard it as Barry or something. Or something. And I think I said a different name. And then after I was done, I was I was talking to Vana like, oh, oh, I I messed up that time. Oh, I hope. I hope they don't feel too bad. You hurt Elliot. Was it Elliot? Did I say Elliot? That's even worse. Apologize to him. Okay, I I actually feel kind of bad for saying the name wrong. So, Brandon. Brandon number... Brandon number two. I know there are a lot of Brandons out there, but... To, to Brandon, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Brandon, for calling you Elliot. I don't know what got into me. He is crying now. <laughs> yeah. I thought you remembered names well. Well, yeah, but... Don't you get a little self-conscious on stage and... During presentations? I do. Uh, he probably unsubbed. I probably deserve that though. But it's okay. Brandon, one day you will come back and realize how amazing I am and maybe I'll have my redemption arc one day.
Ah. Uh, we can get a new Brandon instead. No, but it's not the same Brandon. It won't be the same. Uh, but... Yeah, I wanted to do a Zatsudan because... I wanted to talk to you guys. Oh, 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 oh guess what? Guess what, guys? Guess what, guys? Oh, yeah, okay. So, guess what, guys? So... Power Wash Simulator? Now I can play it whenever I want. So... That's awesome. It, it was a it was a pretty uh, recent announcement, so I'm pretty excited. And I was waiting, and I couldn't handle it. I couldn't. I I just couldn't wait because I don't know when I would have been able to play it. So I I played it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Power wash was just so good, but. But now, now that I don't have to wait for permissions and I can just stream whenever I want, I can... I can save it! Yeah. You got featured in their art too. Yeah! It was awesome! Wait, like right now? Am I allowed to? I mean, I, I already have it on the schedule, so... Oh, I can't wait to show you guys the new features. It's awesome. It's amazing. Oh, man. And also, I thought about playing more House Flipper since there's a lot of content for House Flipper. Uh... The save file is gone again. So... What? Why? Why? But maybe it's just because it's on my personal account. Maybe if I open it... Maybe if I open it up on the crony account... It might still be there. Actually, maybe I should check. Should I check right now? Maybe... Maybe I just didn't save. Maybe that's what it is. Uh, let's see... Just tell it to come back. Well... That's not gonna... That's not gonna happen. You see, I think I think I heard it somewhere, or I read it somewhere. You see a broken plate. You apologize to it. Do you think that broken plate will be pieced back together? No. Unless you rewind time like me. That doesn't count. However, you people can't do that. So it doesn't work. You underestimate my power. What? What does that mean? So, if I can rewind time, can't I fix it? I can! But also, the, the challenge is nice, don't you think? Don't, don't try it. Uh, I'm... I'm not a poser. I'm not a poser. I'm just... Amazing. You see... People who... Uh, have... Powers like me. We don't flaunt it. Unless we have to, of course. Hmm. For example, right now? Is 
it's 10.24. No, it's not. However, I made you look. And it was. It was before you looked at the time to double check. Mm hmm. Ha ha ha. Ah ha ha ha. Ah. I changed it. Before you took a look. You got me, I know. I'm pretty amazing. Yeah, time distortion. <laughs> oh. Can you change it again? No, I've only done it once and you are not going to get another opportunity. Crony, that trick is pretty lame. No, it's not. Can you do it? I don't think so. Uh, I heard that Morbius is going to have a sequel. Isn't that such good news? Maybe they'll actually have the quote. I'm Morbin. Morbin time. Yes. It's great news. Morbius watch along now. Well, as much as I would love to do that, uh, if you'd like to pay... How much was it? $25? Instead of renting it? Then be my guest. If you want to own it for a lifetime, be my guest. However, I do not want to have it forever. <laughs> You can rent on YouTube, Crony. No, I can't. I checked. You can only buy it. Uh, I think it really depends on the region, but... Yeah. But later when it becomes rentable. Oh yeah, of course. Mm-hmm. Give me a second. Here you go. Morbin time. Thank you. <laughs> Just watch Avatar. Hmm. Hmm. No. I mean, yes, we are going to watch Avatar The Last Airbender next week. That's not on me. That's on you guys. I... I tried to get... Uh, I tried to convince you guys otherwise, but you guys really wanted to watch Avatar. And... I can't stop that. Uh... <laughs> That's on you, crony. No, it's not. No, we didn't. Yes, you did. Because we we did a poll together twice. Maybe even three times. You guys all went for the... The, 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 the avatar. Okay, not three times. Twice. It's better than... Uh, live action Dragon Ball. Huh. I've watched that, so... It wasn't good. Yeah, no, it wasn't good. And at the end of Dragon Ball... I think they had a cookie scene, which hinted that there'd be a sequel, but they never made another sequel now. Why is that? I wonder. There might have been some people who were looking forward to it. <sighs> and thank God for that. <laughs> yeah, they're not gonna make a sequel. Uh, we know that now, after years and years. And 
I'm gonna drink some tea. Uh, Come pie. Everyone, we're watching the blue Avatar, right? Aang's also blue, so. Oh, thank you to RX Aces. Let's see. Oh, Hupta! On a totally unrelated note, I would not recommend Oreo ice cream cake with chili peppers for toppings. It's not so bad. Has like sweet and spicy. I think it's a good combination. We should all try it sometimes. I wouldn't. But you guys should. Because you guys deserve the best. gonna have some breath mints. Got it a few days ago. I wasn't going to buy it. But it was limited stock. So I had to get it. Why do you need mints? Because I, I like them. I like him strong. Does your mouth smell or something? No, not really. I just like the taste of him. Does that mess with the tea flavor? Oh, it makes it more fresh and cold. Probably. Curiously strong mints. I think that's what it's called. No. Oh, wait. Yeah, it is. Arctic. Arctic. I love those. It makes your breath so fresh. Mmm. I do like mint, but I don't like spearmint because it's a little too weak. Like it when it's, uh, Packing a punch. Try drinking cold water after. Yeah, I'll drink tea. Uh. Choco mint? Mint ice cream? Um. I can see the appeal. Yeah. Uh huh. I I can see why people like that. Mm hmm. <laughs> I- I can respect it. Are you judging those people? No, no. Like, they're all- Everyone's entitled to what they like, and that's okay. And... I can see the appeal for a lot of things. I'd like to think that... I'm a... Relatively agreeable person. Num yum. The subtle slander. Um. Anyway. Uh. Speaking of Avatar, guys. Speaking of Avatar. The blue one. It's having a sequel. Isn't that amazing? I don't remember anything from that movie. I don't remember any quotes. I don't remember what really happened. It was just... Like... Like a real-life sword art online. Virtual reality. 
something. Ryan Gosling was amazing. Ryan Gosling was in Avatar? Or are we talking about the SNL where he was talking about uh, how the Avatar movie uh, was uh, using the font Papyrus for their title? Because that one was pretty funny. Why does this always come back to Gosling? You, you, okay, not you guys, but someone mentioned it. That's why I'm talking about it. Oh, you like SNL? Not really. I just see clips on YouTube and some of them are funny. Some of them aren't, but that's okay. That's what humor is. Hmm. Hmm, let's see. Oh. Whew. Fresh. Fresh mints. People were curious about your YouTube memes. I have YouTube memes? I never knew that. Oh! Saw that Gura made a, uh, a perfect, perfect avatar of me for the, the wrestling game. That, that was, um, pretty tasteful. I appreciated that. Ah. <sighs> Kind of a shame that I lost, but honestly, rigged. Rigged. I'm sure that if I played it, or if I was there, it could have been a pretty, pretty good match. But... The, the... The wrestling game, is it all just observing? Like a real wrestling match? Or do you get to interact in any sort of way? Give your character special buffs? Or. Oh, you can play it. Oh, but you can set it to AI. Can you put it to... Uh, can you set a difficulty on those AIs? Cause that'd be cool. Hmm. Yeah, cause... I, I think I remember... Seeing how she tried to do a body slam, but that didn't work out. Just, just fell on the ground. The cold, hard ground is a little confusing. Hmm. Oh, it's not any better. Okay. <laughs> and I used a ladder. And a bat. Yeah, but it was funny. And the intro? Oh, man. Daydream. <laughs> uh. She didn't give me any special moves. That's okay. There's always next time. W where, where did... Where did I even get the ladder from? I don't get it. Or the bat. Oh, thank you, Alpha Maffy. Wanted to go to Anime Boston, but I couldn't go there. So I'm frustrated. Glad that you felt excited, my dream girl crony. Thank you. It it's okay, though. Because there's always going to be next time, right? So. No need, no need. 
All the weapons are from underneath the ring. Really? Is that how wrestling works? You can just take out random items from underneath the ring and beat the living heck out of them? Is that how it works? Next time is not now. Wow. Patience. Patience, crony. Depends on the script. Huh. WWE is rigged. Well, well, gee, I wonder why. <laughs> mm. How'd you how'd you tell? Was it the the ladder that just spawned out of nowhere and nobody's stopping them? I'm just, I'm just I'm just kidding, of course. But I've never watched wrestling. Well, I've seen seconds of it when you know you go to. You go to some drinking places and they have TV on and have some wrestling. Mostly it's hockey <laughs> or curling. Oh, thank you, QB. Yeah, no, it's mostly just hockey and curling. Why? Why is curling so intense? I don't get it. Like, isn't that just golf, but on ice? I bet that's a hot take. I'm sorry to all the people who enjoy curling. It seems like an interesting game. But why are you scrubbing the ice? I'm, I'm sure you have to do that to make it go faster. I don't really understand the dynamic of it. I'll probably have to look it up. I'm sorry, curling fans. To make it clean. Oh, to reduce friction. Huh. Gotta sweep, sweep, sweep. Who wouldn't want to sweep competitively? That is, that is true. I tried ice skating. Yeah, I wasn't very good at it. <laughs> I wanted to, but I don't think I'm. Mm, I don't think I'm comfortable with those, like those, uh, those rollers in your shoes. Uh, what's it called? Heelys. I was afraid of those too. And rollerblading, that was pretty scary to, uh, yeah, scooters, scooters too, not good. How many times, uh, did I fall? So, so many times. It feels like you have no control at first, and it keeps going on. She ain't a skater, girl. <laughs> she said, see you later, boy. Did you get your fingers skated over? Oh god, that's terrible. It definitely takes some practice. What if I, you know, do a face plant? That'd be scary. Ooh. I... I know, I, I don't have good experiences with sports in general. Uh, like, for sports... So, for horseback riding... I... fell off while... I was, um... I fell while the horse was running. So... That hurt? That hurt quite a bit, and yeah, I went horseback riding um, uh, several times, but not enough to be called a professional or 
intermediate even, pretty amateur. But for some reason, the people were... The, the people they were leading at the front were experienced, so they decided to run. And because of that, my horse started running too, and I fell off. That hurt. Did you like the horses? Yeah, the horses were cool. They were nice. And they were treated well, which I appreciate. Did I cry? I don't cry over those. Was a horse hurt? No, fortunately no. But uh, the saddle was broken. And I think I, I, I just had bruises, but didn't really break any bones. Did you get injured bad? No, that's the thing. See, I've gotten into plenty of accidents, but I've never had my bones, uh, get broken. It's kind of impressive. I think I'm just really, really built different. Uh, thank you, Ninebreaker. Glad to hear you and the cronies had fun at... Austin sounds like an amazing experience. Uh, I would love to attend one day, but traveling halfway around the world takes a lot of time that I don't have. Mm -hmm. uh, so I'll do my best to try and support you from here instead. Oh, thank you, Nightbreaker. Uh, I hope that one day I can mm, meet as many people as possible. But, let's see... Uh... What else? Oh! Oh, hey, you guys want to hear uh, some of my experiences? Did I tell you about all the bike incidents? Oh, wait, yeah, I did. Never mind. Did I, did I tell you that I broke my helmet? Because I fell down so hard? Or that I had brief amnesia. And then that other time, uh, I broke my bicycle. I had to get another one. Wait, what did I not tell? Uh... And then, and then what else? There were, there were so many accidents. Where do I, where do I begin? Hmm. Didn't I? Ooh, I remember, uh, going trick-or-treating. And... I think, I think, um, was passing by this house that was really well decorated. And... This... This person just jumped out and scared me so hard that I freaked out and ran to the road. But someone, fortunately, uh... <laughs> grabbed me by the collar just in time. And I, I kid you not, a few centimeters away, the car was just zooming by right in front of me. That was insane. I almost got hit by a car, yeah, if someone didn't stop me. That could have been bad. Yeah, but you see, the reason why I was scared was because uh, they used an actual chainsaw. <laughs> uh, probably with no saw blades, maybe, but regardless, I was pretty scary, and uh, they jumped out of the fence. I thought they would stay uh, in their yard, but no, they <laughs> they decided to step outside with the saw. 
So, yeah, scary. Uh, so this is why you're afraid of horror. Mm. Nah. There's a different reason for that. But it's all good. Person went overboard. Not just a just a wee little bit, but it's not so bad. Oh, tell us the reason. I was just never. <laughs> it's gotten a lot better, but see, back then, my my heart just cannot handle jump scares, and horror is pretty much all about jump scares. And I still haven't watched any rated R horror movies. Uh, or just movies that contain a lot of jump scares in general. Like, let's see, what's the, what's the most... What are one of the most popular horror movies? Like, Grudge? Or Ring? Uh, Evil Dead? That's just violent. The recent one, that is. And... What else? Oh, The Exorcist, the older version I watched. That wasn't so bad. As long as there aren't any jump scares, I'm okay with it. Uh, what else? The Saw series? Oh god, no, don't. Don't mention that. That's just, that's not even horror. That's just, just gore. Insidious was hilarious. That was funny. That that I actually laughed while I was in the theater. Cause man, the makeup—it's amazingly questionable. Same, right? Yeah, it's it's funny. The music and yeah, the the villain stuff. No alien, no no no. Prometheus, I heard it was pretty violent, but I really like the person who acted as David. I think they were just a really good actor. I still haven't watched it, of course, but when I've seen bits and pieces, that was great. We gotta do a horror movie watch along. Uh, preferably with no gore. Annabelle's probably okay. What are the what are the ones that I watch? Ooh, I want to watch the Blair Witch Project. Yeah, you know the found footage horror. I'm really interested in that. Ooh, The Shining! I haven't seen that, too. Uh, yeah, I'm fine. The ones... The ones I watched were... Sinister? <laughs> Mama, that was pretty funny. Uh, Exorcist. And, uh, yeah, I said Insidious. Uh, what was it? Uh, uh, um. Oh, Hereditary. Yeah. That was, that was pretty interesting. The Nun? Oh, I watched The Nun. Yeah. Uh, Midsommar... 
So the movies where I'm interested, but uh, afraid to kind of watch the entirety of it, I usually just spoil myself by reading uh, the wiki. Midsommar was something. Have you seen these or just interested? Oh, I've seen those. Oh, Hereditary has gore. Yeah, just, just for that one moment, but it's okay. Train to Busan? I haven't watched that one. It's just about zombies, right? Didn't they have a sequel? Texas. Oof. The host. The host. I don't remember that. It sounds familiar, though. Uh, Final Destination. Oh, I think I have watched that. The older version. It was still pretty disturbing, so I wouldn't want to watch that. Huh. Baba Duke. You won't be laughing when you hear his name. Pee pee man. How about it follows? Uh, no. But I think I did spoil myself because I was interested about the premise of it. Um. Bye bye, man. <laughs> bye bye, man. Bird Box? I don't think Bird Box is a horror movie. But it was interesting. Kind of like that one. I like movies where you can think, theorize about a bunch of things. Quiet Place. I haven't seen Quiet Place. I heard that mm, you should be watching that in a theater. Because. Uh, that movie is more of an auditory experience. Hmm. But, yeah. Silent Hill? Silent Hill movies probably weren't that good um, in comparison to the games. Let's see. I'm trying to think. Mm. Oh, I used to read a lot of books. I don't know what happened, but meh. Do you guys have favorite books? Do you read light novels? No. Animorphs? <laughs> Goosebumps? Morbius, you, you read Morbius, wow! The Giver. Wasn't that just, uh... I, I actually like that book, but... Uh, isn't that a, like, a material that you have to read for school? Oh, oh yeah, Sumi Pun Pun. Wanted to read that one. Uh, yeah, but didn't get the chance to. I think I read, uh, Flower of Eagle. Wait, but anyway, that's, that's manga. I like Lord of the Fireflies, though. 
And I read somewhere that uh, the writer, uh, p -p 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 -p, the, the, the writer for Lord of the Flies, uh, actually based the kids from his student because he's a teacher. <laughs> so that was funny. Like, man, must have hated the kids. Did I say Lord of the Fireflies? What the heck is wrong with me? Lord of the Flies. Didn't that teacher hate the kids? Yeah, yeah. 1984, I haven't read that one. Hmm. Yeah. Seemed interesting. Look at all these. Look at all these good books. Recently, I've been trying to, uh... Read a book that my friend recommended. I'm still- I'm still reading it. On and off. It's a- it's a philosophical book. But thank you to Paula Versatility. Versatility? What is wrong with me? Versatility. Uh, hey crony, your streams encouraged me to turn away from a self-destructive path and I signed up for a sword class. There's a sword class? Uh, the next time you see me, I hope I'll be a real knight. Hey! I hope you have fun and play safe, okay? That's awesome. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Oh, I keep I keep having these uh, stories to tell, but I forget. I'm so good with forgetting. Why is that? Oh, I might have to pull my wisdom teeth this year. Which kind of makes me a little afraid. How long are you out of commission uh, if you take all your wisdom teeth out? All four of them. What happens? Ten days? Sounds like quitter talk. I could, I could probably handle three days. Like, I could probably get it done on Thursday or Friday, then suffer, then come back on Monday. But it, it, it really can't be that bad. But I'd rather pull all all of them out than just two. And then another pair after you recover. I I, I just want to get it over with. I heard that uh, it's a lot more painful if you pull them out. Like, pull all of them out, but I just want to get it over with. Just go all four. I hope so. Can you record how you talk after the surgery? I, I don't think I'd be aware. Uh, someone else will have to do the recording. No, I'm probably gonna dox myself. Like, oh, oh. Uh, hey. Uh, do, do, do you know who I am? 
I'm perfect. I'm perfect. I'm like like and and the the doctors and nurses would go. Yes, 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 crony. Yes, you're the warden of time. Yes, of course. I believe you. Oh yeah, I've, I've, I've rewind and for, for, I've, yes, yes, Crowley. Wow, that's amazing. <laughs> uh, the doctors probably don't watch Hollow Life. No, it's not just about that. It's. It's a secret information that I'm the warden of time. We gotta, we gotta carry on our secret mission and time. They, they can't know that I'm time, or else they'll probably beat me up. Anyone who <laughs> beats me in person would say, "Hey, hey, give me some more time." And man, that would suck. It's like a Karen. Like, hey, hey, I would like it if you can give me more time and just keep nagging. And what can I do, really? Like, yo, just a, I'm just a manager. I can't do anything. Wouldn't you just kill them? No. Because if I'm gonna be around here, then. I have to play by the rules! You're getting your fangs removed? No, 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 no. Uh... The... the teeth... that you can't see... Getting those removed, my invisible... teeth. Yeah, no, no. Can I buy your fangs? What would you do with them? They're- they're not very valuable. Just saying. Make your own. Make your own. If you need dentures, just make them yourself. And you can include fangs on that one, so it'll work out. <sighs> Clone crony? No, you can't do that. Why would we use your fangs for dentures? You don't know. You don't know that. Nobody knows. When's the wisdom uh, teeth removal? Um, not sure. We'll see. Oh, but speaking of that, I'm also, um, getting scaling done. I think that's what it's called. You know, just cleaning your teeth. I, I kind of enjoy it, oddly enough. Yeah, getting the tartar removed. Yeah. Your scales are getting removed? Yes. I am, actually. Yeah, I do enjoy it. Don't you guys enjoy it? Like, getting your teeth cleaned and... It feels much better, and it's chill. Like, sure, they're scraping, scraping on your teeth, but it's nice. It hurts? Why would it hurt? I... I don't think it hurts. Huh. And even if it hurts, isn't it a good kind of pain? 
Don't you guys like pain? You guys are cronies. But you guys enjoy the pain. Those hook things hurt like heck. Really? Wait, I'm gonna look this up. Nah, nah. Ah, it's not so bad. And speaking of, you guys should, you know, get your teeth clean too. Got to do it sometimes. Stop projecting your M's. <laughs> I'm not. My goodness. You calling this dirty? Yeah. Dirty. Go clean up. Can you clean our teeth? Do I look like a dentist to you? Do you get a lollipop from the dentist? Do, do you get one? I thought that was just something that uh, came out from cartoons. Is that real? I don't think it's real. Huh. Power wash our teeth, please. Oh, that sounds horrifying. It's real. Is it real nowadays? You don't get one. You get one? You still get one? At this day and age. Why would they do that? That doesn't make any sense. Candy's bad for you. So why would they encourage that? It's only real in the U.S. I see. Can grown-ups get it too, or is it just for kids? So you can go back. I mean, you'll have to go back regardless. You don't really have any choice. Oh, it's just for kids. Oh, you. You kids. Oh, you just outed yourself. It's okay. It's okay if you're a kid. We're, 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 you know, we're, we're all cool. Doxing, doxing yourselves. Oh my. Now let's talk about the fun stuff. Like root canals. No. <laughs> let's not. Ooh, I want to keep all my wisdom teeth, though. Seems fun. I hope they can pull it out in one go. I want to see it. It looks like... Looks like... A tree root. I want to see it. For what purpose, though? I mean, just... Just to look at it. Don't you want to look at it? it? Haven't you guys ever had those, uh, moments where... Uh, you get your... You get your tooth pulled out and... Stick your tongue over the empty spot. Go, so, oh, wow! Look at all this space! Dang! Do you still have your baby teeth? Of course not. Yeah, see? I hate this talk! <laughs> okay, okay, okay. But before we move on, I would just like to say that I... pulled out all the baby teeth by myself. I'm pretty hardcore like that. 
Mm-hmm. Like, hey, same. Nice. You didn't do the doorknob trick? That sounds painful. I I never did that. I just used my hand. Every time, every time it started shaking, uh, I would shake it a bit more so that I can hear a bit of crack. And and then I know that it's ready. And then I start pushing and pulling at it. And it just rips apart. It was uh, pretty painful, yeah. But also... Exciting. <laughs> stop, please! Okay, yeah, I'll stop. No, 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 I'll, I'll stop. I'll stop! What a terrible day to have. <laughs> uh... You're kind of crazy. No! No! There are, there are quite a few number of people here who did the same thing, and I'm proud of you. <sighs> Why are you my Oshi? Why are you a crony? Hmm? Chat reflects a Oshi, more like Oshi reflects a chat. Ever thought about that, huh? That's right. But... Oh. Oh! 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 Uh, by the way... By the way, uh, I'm, I'm getting stuff prepared for moving. It's still pretty crazy right now, but I'm excited. And I can't wait to soundproof the place. That's gonna be fun. It always... <sighs> Maybe it's a little nerdy, but I love... Uh, doing audio stuff and uh, treating the room is always so much, so much fun. At first, it's it's really echoey, right? And then after you do some treatment to your room, uh, you can't hear any echo. Ah, oh, it's so satisfying. Audio stuff is fun to do. Yeah, it is. I haven't been able to do that much lately, though, but... Mm, hopefully, after after I start moving and get the projects going, I hope I can have more involvement with audio editing. And I like that. Mixing is a pain, that's right. But once you start learning it, it, it's it's pretty fun, especially when you start to understand. I think it goes for a lot of hobbies in general too, like for drawing and uh, I guess being a speedrunner even, or video editing, a lot of things. And yeah, it's fun. You've been mixing for six or seven years now, right? Um, let's see. I'm trying to think. I think so. I think maybe six years. Can't wait for it, crony. Thank you. And you don't have to worry about the police and the FBI cars. Yeah, now they'll never find me. It'll be great.
Mm. Have you guys uh, tried looking into things that uh, you guys enjoy? Do you nerd out a little about the hobbies that you like? I like hearing about that stuff. Oh yeah, yeah, you've started drawing more. No, I'm not a nerd. Okay, okay. The wording. The wording must have been wrong. Is there anything that you guys are passionate about and want to know more about? Mm. Bad attention span. I get that. Nerding out about movies. Nice. Photography. Ooh. Yeah, I like that too. Mm. I like editing. I like editing photos too. Especially when you can straighten them out. That's a... Uh, awesome. Oh, trains! Motorcycle. Ooh, you're watching a meteor shower. Wow, that's awesome. I... I was really into astronomy, too. And I bought a... I bought a telescope back then. And... Man! When you can match, uh... Yeah, when you can, I guess, uh, match the proper focus, the moon is so pretty. And it's so surreal, too. Did I see Sana? Oh, yeah, Sana, Sana is pretty big, yeah. Have I seen any eclipses? Um, I think so. I don't really know. But yeah, I, I was pretty naive about telescopes. I thought... I thought that if I got one, I'd be able to see the... The galaxies, the Milky Way... The stars... Like... Hubble space quality, but no. No, I was wrong. It was naive. A blood moon eclipse. Ooh. False advertisement. <laughs> Happens, yeah, and it happens to the best of us. The blood moon rises yet again. When will Boros get a room? Boros will share my room. That's okay. Okay, Zelda. <laughs> How many hobbies have I tried out? Let's see. Um, I've tried writing before. I used to write poetry. And... It almost got submitted in the yearbook. Uh, back in my previous Wii. Time Academy days, but yeah, they they didn't publish the yearbook, so it was it wasn't released. Kind of a shame. Crony, you strike me as a slam poet. No, no, I, I'm too. I I was too shy for that. Is it cringe? Oh yeah, probably. 
I mean, that was written when I was a... A wee, a wee crony. <sighs> I want to hear your poetry one day. Aw, oh, thanks, man. Do I have some samples? Probably, but... I don't know. Yeah, I'm infinite years old. How long is that? A long, long time. But... Yeah, can't really... Can't really call them poems, really. They, they were just written out of boredom. Nothing, nothing that I wanted to pursue professionally, obviously, but it was, it was just free verse. And that's just a short story in disguise, really. Huh. Musings out of boredom, yeah. But I want to hear it one day. Thanks, man. Probably isn't gonna be that good. Uh... Wanted to write... Wanted to write books, too. I... <sighs> it's just... The, the thing is... I like writing about the setting and the characters and... Uh... I guess... Lore expansion and whatnot, but I just couldn't get to the writing part. I was really bad with that. Yeah, but I would draw out the maps and the town names and the characters and characters' histories, world building in general. It was a lot of fun. Would make a lot of, uh, different, different worlds and <laughs> just leave them like that. I should be a DM. No, no. Being a DM requires a lot of work. Sound like a game master for D and D? No, no. I've I've played it before. Um, yeah, being a game master, it's it's difficult because you're pretty much carrying the entire game. Yeah, DMs are amazing at what they do. Yeah, high stress. Ooh, I've seen some online D&D uh, &D, uh, websites, creators, I don't know, but they're pretty good. When I was looking at that, I was thinking to myself, dang, those effects are so tasteful. I wanna, I wanna help. I want to help the DMs make a, you know, a good map, good tokens. Yeah, I think, I think it was, uh... Wait, was it? I think it might, but, but, but I think it might have been the Foundry. Because, uh, that one supports codes from other people. I could be wrong. Do you have a personal type of setting? Uh... I've only tried... Uh... Final Fantasy because the... Uh... The DM was a... Was a big fan of Final Fantasy XIV, so... It was a lot of fun. I was a... I was a McCoat.
Yeah. I I had no idea what was going on. You got Final Fantasy OCs. Well, they made one for me. And I think uh, her name was Rawlhe. Yeah. Except this fantasy is never final. <laughs> How's it spelled? Uh, I know the spelling, I just don't know where the apostrophe goes. Vralhi. Uh, v R A L apostrophe H E. Of course, there's an apostrophe. <laughs> yeah, I think um, I think I used a name generator for that one because I had no idea. Yeah, I I think that's how it's spelled. Yeah, Ralhi. I think that's where the apostrophe goes. Good times. Had a lot of fun. But... Yeah, nowadays... It's kind of hard to arrange time for... Uh, hangouts with friends, but... That's okay. I'll just have to make time for everyone. And... Yeah, I hope I can make time for you guys, of course. And time for friends and just just everyone that I care about and you guys should do the same too work life balance crony <laughs> you're right you're right Do TTRPG with the council. Um, I, I'm I'm like a real amateur. I've only played it for a few months, so I, I don't think I'd be good as a DM. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know how to be a DM. I'd have to get so many, so many stuff. I I knew that um. A DM friend of mine, they had the 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 die, the the custom die. It doesn't have to be custom, of course, but it was a die, and uh, they had maps, papers, and a lot of improvising, uh, being a shopkeeper and whatnot. You need the you need the handbooks. <laughs> but no, I, I know it's not impossible. If I if I do my research, I know that I'll be able to do it. Otherwise, DMs they should not <laughs> exist if it was impossible. We all gotta start somewhere. Yeah. Slide into those DMs. <laughs> oh, speaking of board games, wanted to play Monopoly. Didn't know um it was out for Switch. And it seemed like mm, pretty high quality. I want to play that. I thought you hated it. I don't hate it. 
I just don't like playing that game with that person who mocked me. Aside from that, it, it's okay. No, I'm not gonna cry. You just don't like losing. I... Yeah, 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 kind of, actually. <sighs> no one likes losing. Yeah, if there's someone who actually enjoys losing. Come on, buddy. You can do better than that. My Oshi is a try hard. Excuse me? Ex did you did you just say that? You're, you're canceled. <sighs> I shake my head. I bite my thumb at the... No one's ever finished playing Monopoly, because... Because everyone dies at the end of the day. Oh. What? You egg stabs. You bite your thumb at me? Yes. Wee oui, wee, oui, I bite my thumb at thee. What art thou gonna do about it? Uh. But there are a lot of different editions for Monopoly. Uh, there's like what? Nintendo Monopoly and... Uh... Monopoly, but for sore losers? Apparently that's a thing. And... what else? Oh, Hello Kitty. That was a thing. And... There was even Breaking Bad. That was funny. There's a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Monopoly. Really? Goodness. Spider-Man. Dang. So many Monopoly variants, yeah. Zelda Monopoly, mm-hmm. Probably Pokemon, too. Everything has had a version at one point. Yeah, Monopoly is one of the most ambitious... <laughs> ...board games. Board game crossovers, you could say. Oh, there's no FNAF Monopoly. That's a lie. I'm gonna look that up. You're lying. I almost typed Five Nights of Freddy's Morbius because of you guys. Thanks. Uh, Monopoly. Wait, what? What? Why is this a thing? Ooh, what? I thought you were joking! Oh my god, it's real. Why is it real? Oh my god. More bobbly. I hate you. Why do you never believe us? Because it sounds absurd. FNAF Monopoly? 
also, when's uh, FNAF gonna have the movie released? That was gonna be produced by, what, the... The... the, the, the studio who created Paranormal Activity, was it? Blumhouse Productions? When's that gonna happen? We're not the absurd ones, they are. That's true. Voice by Chris Pratt. Yeah, yeah. Ouija had a Barbie crossover. Is the Barbie Ouija board in this photo real? Oh! Okay. It's not official. Oh, uh, who owns the Barbie brand? O okay. Huh. But still, that's... What are they thinking? Why? Why is this a thing? No, it's not fan made. It's a uh, made by an actual company. But why? I don't understand. Why? Why do I even bother understanding sometimes? It's real. Yeah, look it up. People make mistakes. Wait, if you use the Ouija board, the, the Barbie Ouija board, does that mean I'm gonna get, like, mean girls, ghosts? And they're hovering over, like, H E Y Y Y Y Y are you here? Y A S S. <laughs> did you did you kill someone? S L A Y Y Y Y. <laughs> That would be so bad. Man. I... Oh my goodness. The yes and no are replaced by totally yes. Totally no. Man. I would never, I would never use this. Even if I wanted to speak to the living, if I see this board, I'm just gonna look for something else. Like, you like... You like your ghosts? Your ghost homies? Uh, eat W! Ugh. Man. Why didn't they use this Ouija board for the horror movie? Because I know there was a horror movie for uh, Ouija boards. Uh, you guys wanna... Come pie with me? Because I'm thirsty. Thank ah. I'm gonna pour some more water. How's the hybrid tea? It's nice. Almost calming, you could say.
Give me a second. Mm-mm, good. Is it really calming or is it a placebo? I'm pretty sure it's a placebo, but you know what? I'll take it. <sighs> Crony, what is a hybrid tea? So you combine barley and chamomile. And you can do the same thing too. For example, if you have green tea, you can combine green tea and whatever else is out there. Heck, hot cocoa even. Go for it. Milk and orange juice? Yeah, sure. I mean, they have a... Uh... Orange chocolate? That's... that's okay. That's creativity. Ooh. Nice. Sweet or no sugar? Uh, when it comes to tea, no sugar. I do like London Fog, though. Yeah. I like a lot of a lot of the tea that's out there. Like let's see. Um thinking. Thinking. Of course there's milk tea, uh English breakfast tea, Earl Grey. And well, green tea, barley tea, oolong tea, jasmine tea, and uh, Irish coffee is in tea. London Fog's pretty much Earl Grey with milk, no? Name 17 other teas. Oh no. Oh no. Yuzu tea? Uh, Darjeeling! Darjeeling tea! Yeah! Apple tea, I, I have never had that. Gunpowder tea, mmm, delicious. Mmm, I like uh, pepper powder tea. Fantasy. Fanta- Frick, I messed that up. Uh, a, a psalm tea? Yeah, yeah, that, that too. Uh, anxiety. Oh, very good. Tangerine tea. Okay, now, now I don't, now I don't know. Uh,. Loyalty. Ha. 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 Okay, now it's just... Now you guys are just making them up. Now now these are just puns. QT. Destiny. Oh, thank you, Noel. Tears. Mmm, my favorite. Mm-mm. Uh, okay. Okay. Okay, guys. You guys are guilty as charged for making all these puns. So let's uh let's move on. Yeah. But 
I'll probably start reading the super soon, but before that, I wanted to ask you guys. What kind of games do you guys like playing? Guys, hmm? for me... Wait, give me a second. Minecraft. Destiny. Puzzle and adventure. Open world. Ooh. Factorial. Oh, I know. I know some friends who play that game. Rhythm games. Nice, nice. Fallout 4. Silent Hill. Oh, Mega Man. I remember playing that. Uh, which one? Which one did I play? I think I played one where you can switch between Mega Man and Zero. It could be wrong. I, I, I would know if I knew how it looks. It was a it was an SNES game. Mega Man X4? Oh! Yeah, it was this one! Wait... No... No, the... The portraits look a little too high quality. Wait... Okay, maybe it is. Iris! Iris! Oh. What am I fighting for? Wow. <laughs> yeah, I think it might have been X. X3 is in SNES. I'm probably thinking... Thinking... Wrong. Actually, I think it might have been X3. It might have been X3. If only I see the first stage. If only I could take a look at the first stage, I might know. I'm gonna look it up. The music was a bomb, though. Look up a playthrough. I probably will. Mega Man. No, not Mega Mind. Why am I getting Newt Newt memes? <laughs> like, why? I haven't even been looking that up. Why? Why is that? Is that the new meme lately? I don't even know. Whatever. They know you have memes. Ah. Wait, is this the beginning? I don't... I don't recall this. It, it was in a... It was in a broken down city. No, this isn't... This isn't it. It was in a rundown city. Uh, you start off there and you can control 
Uh, you can hop into a mecha, a little mecha, and start uh, attacking from there. Broken Down City was X1. Okay, maybe there was no zero. Maybe I thought that was there. Because it had a ponytail? I have no idea. I don't even trust... I don't trust anything now. I will never trust my memory. Like a man. Oh! Yo, you guys are amazing! It's Mega Man X! Yeah! Oh, this is the music! Oh, you guys are so smart. When does he when does he get in the get in the robot? I swear, I swear I swear he gets in the robot somewhere. Yeah, okay, no wonder Zero did make an appearance. No wonder why I thought that way. I get it now. I never went past the second or third stage. Wasn't Zero captured? I have no idea. <sighs> Neither did I. Hey! Wow, but isn't this a relatively old game? Why do you guys remember this? Are you guys boomers? Oh my gosh, I can't believe this. Cronies? <laughs> I thought I thought you were telling me that you were 12 or something. That you got candy from your fellow dentists. What happened? I feel attacked. Hey, I'm sorry. It's just... Just what I thought. I'm not 12, I'm 13. Oh, my bad. It's okay, we boomer together. We boom together. We've matured a lot since then. Yeah. Look what a year can do. <laughs> I'm 12 season 2. <laughs> Aging rapidly. That's okay. Once you graduate from high school, it's all a blur from there. Next thing you know, you're six years old. <sighs> we are morbid here. We're morbid our ages. We're, we're true morbers. No more morb memes. I... <laughs> no. No. No, it's gonna last at least a week more. I'm sorry, but I'm not. I have 
fun. I I saw some really good fan art of um of me Morbin, and I don't know. While it's very impressive, at the same time, why? Why? Oh, the video. Yeah, the video too. Excuse me, what? Why am I getting this kind of recommendation? What? <laughs> what? Are you trying to say something? YouTube? Eight signs you're dealing with narcissistic abuse. What? What are you trying to say? Do you want to fight me? Man, that that's rude. I'm I'm closing you too. Throw hands with you too. God, I wish. Uh, whatever. You know what? Whatever. It's fine, because I know it's not real. Anyway, we should start reading this soup, guys. Let's go. The algorithm is really, really interesting. Yeah, it really is. It's, uh... Too interesting. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Mega Man X. Mega Man X. Is that out on, uh, the switch online? I oh, know. Two hours talking with the cute warden. That's great. Hey, thanks, man. I know, I'm pretty cool. Always have been. Always will. Remasters for Steam? Really? Wait, give me a second. I want to see that. Wow, there are so many, so many re-releases. It's nice. Do they have Mega Man X? Mega Man X, Mega Man X. Mega Man. Mega Man X Legacy. Why is the opening so high quality? Uh, why can I not see screenshots? Why? Is the internet not working? That would have made sense or else why else would I still be here? Oh, now I can see it. Whoa! What is this quality? These are not pixels anymore! Yo! They have animations on this thing! Yo! There are no pixels! This looks... Kind of strange. I like... I like the pixels. Wait. It looks like... It looks like one of those, uh... 
those things where you enhance the the image and the pixels look really smoothed over as a result kind of looks like that oh my goodness there's iris not not iris you know our our nephilim iris the mean girl Oh wait, this is a filter? I mean, if that's the case... I hope I can turn it off. Wow. Oh, actually! You know a game that I really wanted to play, but couldn't? Because of permissions? Um... Lion King. Lion King. I hate that game so much. I hate it. Man. Yeah, the SNES. Oh my god, I know. I don't even know where to begin. I hate it. And and the the freaking can't wait to be king, the freaking ostrich, you jump and then die regardless, even though you avoided it? Why is that? What is up with that? What is the point of dodging? Like the monkeys? Sure. I, that's fine. That's fine with me. But the freaking ostrich! I jump ahead of time. I jump before. And I still die regardless. The game wasn't fair. Yeah, and it won't even allow you to save. What's up with that? It's a game for kids, right? And I managed to go all the way to the last level. And my god, that is so difficult. Holy moly. Be prepared uh, level was kind of interesting. I think I could like it. Maybe. But I didn't beat it. No, I didn't beat it. Oh, and another trauma I uh, remember from that game. Akuna Matata, the logs and the waterfall. Oh, man. I hate that level so much. Yeah. Why is this a trauma stream all of a sudden? Because we're talking about old games. But that was the best level. How is that the best level? The logs. There has never been a fair Lion King game. I mean, look at Kingdom Hearts. They had a they they had a pretty fair Lion King game. Maybe I should try playing this game. You should. It's like a rage game. You could like it, maybe. That's a stretch. Yeah. I love Simba from the game Kingdom Hearts. Yeah. Ugh. Anyway. Let's, uh... Yeah, let's, let's read this, Supas. But, hey, if you guys are curious... If you guys hated Cat Mario and all the other rage games out there, then Lion King is the game for you. 
Oh, believe me, first level's fine. First level's fun, even. And then, and then comes the second level with the ostriches. Some really hated the monkeys. And then... And then the frickin' Hakuna Matata. The frickin' logs. Gorillas? Sure. Why not? Whatever. But the logs. Oh my god, the logs. And then... And then the last level... They set you up for failure. Yeah. She can't stop venting about- I'm just really salty about Lion King, even- even now. Even Donkey Kong Country? I managed to finish that one. Even though the snow level was an absolute pain with the barrels. But... I still managed. But Lion King? I still didn't. And I'm pretty bitter about that. Thinking of redeeming yourself in Lion King? I haven't even completed Super Mario Sunshine. What makes you think I'll finish? Maybe I will, actually. It's out on Switch. But you know, it's Disney, so I don't think I'll be able to stream it. So therefore, if you guys want to put yourself through pain, go for it. I recommend it. Because... Life. Pain. Just play it off stream. No, it's okay. No, I don't like that kind of pain, crony. Well, don't knock it until you've tried it. <sighs> yeah, but let's see. Do, 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 do. All right. A uh, drink. Come pie. It dink. That water is fresh. How's that tea treating you, girl? Uh, it's great. Heck yeah. Now pop a mint too, crony. Um, maybe not, because I think I've had, um, too much mint. Now my breath is too... Too bright. Too arctic-y. Too... Too cold. Pop three mints, coward. No. Cause I popped in five. You fool. Uh, but do, 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 do. Oh, thank you. Uh, do six, coward. I'll only do it if you do. And I bet you don't have it. Coward. Yes. Uh, thank you to Riceroni, Prophet of Guac, 
Let's see. Nihongo. Nihongo ikimas. うん。いろいろ昨日気持ちを でも、いつも頑張らなくてもいいと思う。無理しないで。お、たまには休んで少し自分のことだけを考えた方がいい。いつも応援してる。大好き。イエーイ。Thank you. Let's see. I feel like becoming more and more fond of you. I like like that you're always working hard. Sometimes I'm worried, but I also like you. Uh, I think for being straightforward, maybe. Mm. Oh, that's so sweet. Nihongo Jozu. Arigato. Oh, thank you, Riceroni. And uh, thank you to your boy, Steven Adams. Mm. How's it going in that conversation you were at with Fauna? Oh, we were, we were nervous, but Fauna did a great job. Mm -hmm. For spirits of time. Glad to know you and the cronies had a great time at the con. Hopefully I get to meet and greet you one day, though the chance is slim. It's okay. Because um some of you guys have really great friends. I know someone who brought in several posters, including you guys. And that was really sweet. And because of that, um, since, since I think, um, yeah, uh, I, I had some time. I was asking if, uh, they wanted a video message since, you know, uh, they, they managed to put in the effort to bring all their friends along. So decided to take the the picture so and, and videos all that it was sweet uh let's see uh thank you to neo matrix and atomic panda sloth hi uh, Hopefully, I can meet up with fellow cronies in the future. Yeah, yeah. And Genzen, just dropping by to say I missed you for no reason. And I hope you're having a great day. Sometimes no reason is a great reason. That means I'm on your mind. And thank you to JD Cadence. 
and number 1729 uh oh I think I uh, read this already, but thank you, number 1729, for the good wishes. And Daniel Kopp. It's my birthday today. Was wondering if I could get a Morbius themed hubda. Hab. Mm Happy Morbin Day! I hope you morb a lot and get yourself more billion gifts and just just morb. Just have a morbin day. Just morber. A morber someday. Mm-mm. Keep on morbin. And thank you to Dark Aeon. Here's my bet money from uh, the WWE stream. Uh, I saw... I think I saw that people were betting that I was gonna win, so... Whoops. My bad, guys. <laughs> and Zaloran. Thank you, thank you. Uh, JHL. And... Thank you to Martin. And useful as you and Q. Bog gang, that's okay. Take it easy, thank you. And Panda POV. Excuse me, um, but thank you. <laughs> Chewy Dewey. Uh, I hope I too get the experience meeting perfection one day. Hope so too, it was awesome. Yeah. Uh... Yeah. I, I really enjoy... Uh, enjoy talking to you guys. And I hope I get more opportunities like that in the future. And honestly, I wish... I wish I can talk to you guys longer, but... It's not really something we can have. I guess due to time constraints at a convention, but... Yeah. It's nice. Maybe someday. Uh, let's see. Uh, thank you to Zame. <laughs> My mom wants to visit Canada. How do I break it to her that it doesn't exist? Just show her a map. Yeah, I, I think I think that's good enough. Just tell her, um, yeah, it's it's just America that exists. Sorry, everything else is a fantasy. I I made my I made it up. My bad, or something. Just to improvise. Just make sure not to hurt her feelings or anything. Thank you to Xenia. A faded memory. Thank you. I feel like I know who that is, but interesting. Uh Roka Dear Senjar. Uh thank you, thank you. And Deadhead. And Pride, no sauna, no life. Thank you. Uh, am I okay after the beatdown I got from the shark? Oh yeah. Because like I said, I never break my bones. I'm pretty built different. And... Uh, Kogetsu? Oh! Let's see... Oh my goodness! Oh, 
Oh, the tumor I had previously, uh, had was cancer, but thanks to Crony's prayers, uh, there was no recurrence at the, uh, at, at uh, June, June examination. Oh, that's a relief. Oh, man. I'm just glad you're, you're around. Kogetsu-san. Uh, <笑>大丈夫。よかった。あ、今、今も。あ、こげさん。覚えてる。うん。お、お体を大事に気をつけてください。<笑> みんなも気をつけてください。あ、I uh, think I think doctor is Isha. Isha を会えてください。Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no! Um, uh, but let's see. Uh, thank you to Kurozora. Uh, for Kronk, the Warden, the Chosen One, Perfect Ten. Uh, Cutie Pie for the match versus Goomb. For real though, I'm glad to see that you and the Boston cronies had a wonderful time. Looking forward to the next opportunity. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Mm. And thank you to you, Stell. Miss Crony so much over the weekend. Oh man! Look at all you guys. Just... just don't. Just don't. Like, there are... there are so many other people. It's okay. I... I... I know that there are plenty of other people out there. So that's okay. Uh, don't be over dramatic. Don't tell us what to do. Whatever. It's not the same. Maybe I don't watch all the girl. <sighs> Just watch vods or something. I don't know. Touch grass. Be productive. Get your teeth cleaned. Get some candy from your dentist afterwards. I don't know. Book an appointment. <laughs> We don't sound like that. Oh, really? Nah. Look, crony. Yeah, that's that's your voice from now on. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, let's see. Thank you to... Let's see... Ojinketsu? Thank you, and I hope you feel better soon. And A12 Flames. Uh, it was so nice to see you at Anime Boston. Uh... Oh, you were called up during the panel! Was the guy who answered the Cali question? Oh, yeah, you. I remember you answering that immediately. I was, man. And yeah, I think you had a uh, track jacket on, the the Omo Cat merch, and I wanted to compliment it, if I recall correctly, that is. But yeah, it was amazing regardless. Yeah, red. Yeah. Uh, but let's 
see. Uh, thank you to Midnight. I uh, saw some pictures of the con. Hope there's more next year. Yeah. Or maybe this year. Yeah, that'd be nice. And I know there are gonna be some people who were sad that they couldn't go, but... It's okay. There are opportunities down the line, and I'm excited to meet more of you, because... Man... Uh, when I recognized some of the people, it was really... it was really nice. Some were quizzing me. Like, hey, do you remember me? And when I did, it, it was it was like meeting a friend. Yeah. And uh, thank you to uh, Croquette. Thank you. Uh, Feline. Uh, good to see you. Hope you had a great time in Boston. Always thank you for wonderful streams. And uh, Neo Matrix. I uh, wasn't able to make it to Boston, but I was there in spirit. Uh, glad that you and the Chromies had so much fun during the con. Oh, like I said, we'll always have more opportunities. Oh, and um, speaking of fan letters... We didn't talk about fan letters. Where did that even come from? Uh... But I... I think in our previous streams, we were, uh... Talking about fan letters. And I got one! I got one from Anime Boston! And it was so sweet! Yeah, I, I wish we can get more. Uh, cause I was asking about it. Like, hey! D do we get any fan letters, by the way? And apparently they got one, uh, at the convention. Yeah, it was nice. And let's see. Uh, thank you to Oya, Oya, Oya Sumi! Here's to our great time warden, chosen one, a perfect ten, cutie pie, coolie pie. Keep up the great work, thank you. Uh, were there any funny ones? Um, I only received one. Uh, they only sent me one letter. But, yeah. Maybe they'll send me more if if people sent uh, more during the convention. Yeah, I don't I don't really know how how they work it out, but it was nice. Uh, let's see, uh, Outlaw Drifter. Uh, thank you, and it's okay. Next time, next time. Sent Morb. What the heck? Well, why? So, do you want more letters? I think I think letters are nice because they're they're really, I guess, how should I say, personal? Because handwriting, uh, handwriting and everything. I think it's very sweet of them to put the time and effort. Yeah, I don't know. I just think it's nice. You sent postcards? Ah. <sighs> yeah, I really hope, I really hope we can get some. That'd be awesome. I can't read or write, sorry. Wow, your typing skills are really good though. Uh, thank you to Koa Yen. Oh, today's your birthday! Hey! Hope da! And uh, thank you to Donasis. Eyebrow game on match. Thank you, thank you. Uh, SAO. 
Konnichiwa, since me birthday was yesterday, can I get a belated hubda? Also, good luck on that driving test you mentioned a while back. I got mine on Friday and I am not ready for reverse parallel parking. <sighs> yeah, good luck. Good luck with that. Um, careful of pedestrians always. And uh, yeah, hubda. Well, now hubda. Huh. Duh. And thank you to Chromie for uh, Soren Era, uh, Corn and Butter. I uh, hope you had a great time bullying and meeting all the cronies at Anime Boston. Special shout out to Casey Akisu for that special poster. Now I just have to sacrifice one crony every day to increase my lottery luck. Uh, I take no responsibility, but yeah. Thank you, Corn. And thank you to Reo. Oh, thank you. And thank you to Honky Dunk. Tell us something embarrassing about Gabe. Hmm. Nah. I don't think there was anything embarrassing about anyone. Therefore, I cannot answer you that question. And uh, thank you to Don Revenge and Top Nep Gear. Uh, glad to hear you guys had so much fun over the weekend. Uh, I was doing birthday stuff with my family, but I tried to keep up with everything that was going on. Hey, birthday stuff! Hey, Hubda! I hope it was fun, Top Nep Gear. Yeah. Spending birthdays with your family. Nice. And thank you to Sylvan Dust, uh, Aquatic Lettuce, uh, She Taco. Oh! Crony, loved your panel at Anime Boston. Looking forward to more fun times with you. Uh, love the Sailor Mars cosplayer at the panel. Oh! Your cosplay was really nice. It was cute. Yeah. It was nice seeing you there. And thank you to Harrison Chan. And Guy Savage. And, uh, thank you to Park Young Gee, uh, Mr. Vig, and Tate Aniki. Uh, glad you were able to enjoy your first anime convention experience. I know plenty of us enjoyed it from our end. And, yeah, no, thank you guys for making it enjoyable. No, it's Tate. Really? Okay, okay. Tate. Okay, okay. Tate. And uh, thank you to Vector Sigma 2. Uh, the Hollow Live panels were the highlight for me at Anime Boston. And I think you succeeded in getting my friend I went with into falling into the VTuber rabbit hole. It was a lot of fun. Hey! What a mistake! Welcome! <laughs> and uh, thank you to uh, Mr. Shadow Ant. Oh, hey, I remember you. Yeah. meant a lot to be able to express my appreciation in person. Hope to do it again. No, thank you. Thank you for, I guess, meeting me. It was really nice. 
And uh, no, Dr. Pepper is not T, Chromie 4. Uh, and thank you to Exile Double P89. Uh, hi, Crony. Wow. Number three of 20. It was great meeting you. Uh, maybe going in my full tactical division cosplay was a little much. Keep being you, Crony. No, that was cool. I... I remember trying to be, you know, like... Trying to compliment the cosplay. And I was like, hey, nice uniform. And you said it was from Division. So I asked if it was from Tom Clancy. And that was that was a nice bonding time. There's a bot. Oh, bot. Bot, why? Uh, but thank you. And Juntal Carlos. Uh, thank you, thank you. This week looks fun, though. I can't wait for more Mert. I mean, Kirby. Mmm. War. No. <laughs> Don't get terminated. Oh, man. If that's the case, I should put it to subscriber mode, huh? Give me a second. Ah. Life. Life, am I right? I wanted to make it inclusive for everyone by disabling it, but it seems we still have to be careful about the bots. Okay. Sigh. Okay. Thank you guys for the warning. And uh, thank you to Soup Theory. I had a dream this morning that you were in WWE. Oh, what a what a dream! What a, what a dream! Woke up in cold sweat. <laughs> And, uh... Kekitan... Ah, Kekitan! It was super nice to meet you in Boston. I'm so happy you remembered me when I popped in chat today. Uh, keep being your perfect self. Of course! I try to remember whenever I can. Uh... And thank you to BL. And Orange Robot. Uh, we'll be need to see you in a convention within Canada sometime. Ooh, out of curiosity, have um, any of the girls uh, been to a convention in Canada? Just, just curious is all. Cause it'd be cool. And uh, thank you to Albert Scoot. I uh, didn't win the gotcha, but the panel was a lot of fun. Looking forward to the next one. Yay! Thank you. I'm getting mixed answers. Not yet, or... Think so, last year. Toronto last year, okay. Ooh. Nice. Uh, but let's see. Uh, thank you to Masonet and Albo Heel. Uh, Kronichiwa. Uh, it's been busy. Work's been busy these uh, past few days. And. Because there have been things that I want to work on, I haven't been able to watch your streams. But uh, work isn't really working out. Haha. 
I made that pun. Ah, oh, me. Uh, and it seems like it seems like the things aren't working out in general. But today is my birthday. Uh, all today's my birthday, so I wanted wanted some sort of comfort, even though it's my work time. It's okay, can you tell me this? <laughs> oh, You know, okay, it's it's gonna it's gonna be okay. Yeah. It's gonna be okay. It, it'll take some time. But let's see. Uh, it wants me to read. Hey, it's all gonna work out. Come see my stream sometimes. Hmm. Yeah. I I really hope it works out. So yeah, well, I'll I'll listen. I'll listen to your request. Uh, yeah. 인마 힘내. 다잘될 거야. 방송도 좀 보러 오고. 자샤. Thank you. And Lin Lin. Uh, thank you, thank you. Uh, colorful B word. Oh, it was great seeing you in Boston. And a uh, nine lie. Thank you, Alejandro Martinez. Yo, I translate. I I translated it for you guys. But anyway, thank you. And Arcana, the Hermit. Oh, it was one of the lucky few to do the meet and greet with you. Had lots of fun at the panel and it was very nice meeting you. Thank you for the great time at Anime Boston. Thank you. So, it's always... It's always fun. Thank you. And let's see, Tsuna. Oh! Tsuna. Uh, like, like Tsunami. Uh, Tsuna. Tsuna Hirochi. I hope, I hope I got your name right. Just wanted to say thank you, Crony. Thank you. I, I couldn't, I couldn't pronounce your name properly. So I had a lot of trouble. I, I hope I got it right this time. Tsuna Hirochi. Tsuna Hirochi. I think, I think, I think that's right. Uh, thank you to... Andy Joe and Rona PC Fund and I hope you fix your memory leak. <laughs> Thanks. And Oh, I was pronouncing it correctly. I was just being cheeky. Okay, Tate. Y'all frickin'. And Toka Tsuomono. Uh, sad I couldn't go to the panel or attempt to go to the meet and greet since I was at a different con, but hope you had a good time. Thank you. I hope that con was fun. And uh, Zafir Haru. Sneaking away from work. Hey, good. Good luck with work. And Frisk Foster. And Deadman W L K N. Oh, had fun with the meet and greet, even though I was super nervous. Hey, I remember. I think I think we were both bonding about how nervous we both were. So it's okay. And it wasn't just you who was nervous. I was also nervous. There were. Uh, a lot of other people who are just as nervous, so you're all good. 
And uh, thank you to Daniel Gold. Here we go, it's Morbin time. <laughs> With $25. Thank you, Daniel. And uh, uh, Walter Depetri. Depetri? And uh, Grumble Dog RX Asus. Uh, Destitute Donye. Uh, thank you. Dronzer. Saw my 3D debut. Thank you, thank you. And Savage Shadow. Uh, dear Madam Perfect Crony Oro, you are indeed perfect. Sincerely, me. P.S. I recommend not stepping on arrowheads on accident. My foot is better. I survived. Also, I can now go back to work so I can sp b b b so I can send more super chats. A. Hey. That's good. I think. Yeah, we were talking about this a few streams ago. Yeah. I was like, yo, yo, how can you step on arrowheads? But I'm glad. I'm glad you're feeling better. And uh, thank you to Ranavis. When's my Switch Sports debut gonna happen? I was thinking either this week or next week. Maybe next week. Maybe. <gasps> Avatar, Watch Along, and Switch Sports. Oh, I just hope I don't hurt my hand like Fauna did. I thought I hurt her when we were, you know, doing the sword fighting. So that her finger was kind of, you know, had some sort of scratch. So I was worried that I did that to her, but it was all good. Iris did too. <laughs> Oh boy. I wanna I wanna do the 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 Chambara. I th I think it's Chambara. The the sword fighting. I wanna do that one. And tennis. And badminton. But probably badminton. Just stay away from your desk. My desk is a little too close. The odds are not looking good for you considering your history. Yeah. Yeah. Play in an open space like Ring Fit. I didn't play Ring Fit in a very open space, but you know what? It's fine, I'll just be careful. Uh, let's see. Uh, thank you to Amelia Wetzel, defective, defective extraordinaire, Lawrence Mill, the chaser of food trucks, uh, Koa Yen. Uh, thank you, thank you, Koa. And I don't know if I've said this already, but hubda. And. Uh, thank you to Fonzie. Uh, Iris said she wants to watch Avatar 2. Oh. 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 Now this gives me an idea. Okay. And, uh, thank you to Fonzie. And Skyred. Syred? And Joseph Rolona. Thank you. Uh, Tatsujin Nation. And the Monkey. Thank you. Ranavis. Can we watch The Notebook instead of Avatar The Last Airbender? Nah, why would we watch The Notebook? Romance? Are you kidding me? No. 
And uh, thank you to Tentacult7336. Shout out to the cronies sharing their pictures at the cons. Mm-hmm. Thank you. And the sweaty one. Thank you. And Oyadzi. Uh, oh, wait. I feel like I can read some of the Nihongo without the translation. Boston uh, de... No-ibento...お疲れ様でした。日本でやることがあれば...I can't read that. Something, something... By the way, when will... When will your next ASMR be? When I... Move. Should I... Should I get a 3DO? I don't know. Oh, okay. Thank you for the event in Boston. If you ever come to Japan, I'd like to participate. Yeah. Um. Um. Ko. Kite. Kite kudasai. Uh. Yeah! Did I do that right? I hope so. And uh, thank you to Quiet Rider and Ed Blake and Alpha Maffy. Uh, thank you, thank you. And the bomb is here. One, two, three. Uh, just finished watching Morbius and it wasn't that bad. Thanks for giving us Blade Runner 2049. Uh, Gosling Bless. Uh, before we all die from The Last Airbender. Looking forward to a great stream week. Glad to have you back. It's good to be back. But also, I've always been here. Come on, man. And uh, blackout thirty one. Wait, where did Gosling come from? What what does that mean? Like Ryan Gosling. What does it mean? And where to come from? But uh, thank you to blackout thirty one. A uh, big shout out to Casey Akisu for bringing some of us that cannot make it to the meet and greet. Uh, thank you for the warm message, Warden. Hope you had a good time. Thank you. Don't worry about it. Okay. You shouldn't have asked that. Did I look it up? Oh, spoilers from a movie. Okay. If that's the case, no need. And uh, thank you to QB. Um, and Hats. Uh, Dorme. Neo. Uh, having run that poll late at night after the first Kroyasumi. It could be said that the 5.5k watching right now didn't ask for that poll result. Also, only the cartoon has Avatar in its name. Or the blue person movie. Ew. I know that. Whoops. Tee <laughs> And... Uh, Wiggleloff. Thank you. Ninebreaker. Uh, thank you, thank you. And Bob. Uh, Corona. Who's the clumsiest in council? You are Fauna. Nobody's clumsy, because we're amazing. We're perfect. Perfect. Uh, speaking from personal experience, don't get hit by a car. It hurts a lot. It probably does. A lot. No kidding, I mean... 
people can die from car accidents, so I, I can imagine that it would hurt. And super tart. Uh, thank you. I don't know if I'll be a guest. Yeah, I don't know. That conventions, organizations uh, for conventions are really not in my area of expertise, but yeah. Hopefully I can attend more conventions this year. And uh, thank you to Jose Gonzalez. Thank you. And Cowby. Yesterday I dreamt about getting a push notification that you're doing a member's ASMR stream. And as I tap that push, bu uh, push button, uh, the stream is already unavailable. It's sad that even in my dreams, I don't get to see your ASMR. <laughs> Don't say that! Don't say that, come on. And, uh, Jinro. Uh, couldn't make it to Boston. But, hope you had a great time. Thank you. And, uh, thank you to, uh, Paul of Versatility. Thank you. Childhood crony is like a protagonist of action movies, only getting bruises and scratches no matter what happens. Yeah, I have a lot of scars. They all kind of faded away though. Let's see. Yeah, they're all gone. Huh. Oh no. Two are still here. Crony looks like she went through a <laughs> meat grinder. <laughs> no, no. Can we know how you got him? Uh, biking. Yep. Do you still have the one from the nail? No. Nah, nah. -uh. Uh, let's see. And uh, thank you to A U Fog Z. Who's my favorite Azumanga Dayo character? Uh... Osaka. I think Osaka has to be my favorite, because she's kind of random. Mmm, who else? Chio, because Chio's pretty wholesome. And... I really like her dog. Chio's dad... Um... I don't know. Uh, no, but I think my favorite character has to be Osaka. And yeah, the cat dad. Yep. And uh, thank you to that one guy. Who reads these days? Hey! People read? Like Kindle? Actually, I don't really like reading from Kindle and like reading from physical copies. And T W A Roni. Thank you, uh, the Red Comet. Uh, you can't drink from straws while you're healing from getting your wisdom teeth pulled. Oh. That, that's okay. I can still live. And uh, Deskine, thank you. Uh, Minute Mate Aisha. I wanted to be one of the uh, female cronies in Anime Boston, but it's okay. 
Because there's always next time. You may, you guys make it sound like there's never going to be another... Uh, another opportunity to go to a convention. Don't worry. There will be more chances. Why does she say every letter of my name? I don't know. Am I supposed to say Twa? <laughs> Twa? Uh, but thank you. And uh, Lawrence Mill, uh, the chaser of food trucks. Uh, thank you. Zinzi Fong. Uh, Kronichiwa. Kronichiwa. Cams. <sighs> Cams. Please. Thank you, uh, Valiant Hero. And uh, thank you to Zinzi Fong once again. What am I playing today? Nothing really. I was just hanging out. And uh, thank you to. RM46 Desk Gun And uh Are you a fan of Devil Man? Yeah, I, I kind of like Devil Man Cry Baby, yeah. And Hey, you like just hanging out. Hanging out's great. Are you not tired of holding your tea for 3 hours? All right. I'll let it go. Eh. Let's see, I miss Akira Tales. Who's with the? What's with the memes? And uh, thank you to uh, R46. Got four wisdom teeth taken at once while asleep. It was pain. Had literal pits behind my molars, having to fish bits of food out of those gaps. Ugh. With toothpicks that I softened and bent into hooks with my soul. Ooh, yeah, good times. Why is that so oddly detailed? Oh, but thank you. And, uh, thank you to Love S, Colin P, a teacher. Ooh! Teacher at high school I went to keep Ooh! I'm not gonna read that Oh human anatomy teacher I think. Whoa what is wrong with her? She should eat it, it's nutritious. Uh but thank you to Grumble Dog and uh the great Billy Mays. You realize you could have gotten 25% more value from the Tooth Fairy if they fell out naturally. Whole teeth have less value. Okay, are you the Tooth Fairy secretary or something? She'll- she'll take what she can get. And... Thank you to Zinzi Fong. What time is it there, crony? Infinite. Thank you to Avenged Me. No, I do not like being stepped on. And Fong slash Miso. Oh, that's sweet. And KN Ant. Oh, dang. Scale models. Oh, tiny scale plane models. That's cool. That's a cool hobby. And uh thank you to Shurat uh Kesik Bayev and Philosophy. Uh, I've never done it before, but I bought a tablet to learn how to draw after watching your stream. Hey, I hope that goes well. I used to draw too, but yeah, it really takes, uh, determination. And thank you to Hanbyar, uh, Pure Boy Darling. And Gavron Z, the Morb of 87. Ha ha ha. Uh, Noelle Selfiel, Jokeroni Lover. Uh, 
dear crony, just want to let you know you've done more uh, than expected to us. You spending time with us, brightening up our darker days with your lovely smile and face, your wholesome and uh, generosity, not taking credit from us, thanking you, just makes us love you even more. And sometimes the gaslighting could be very lit. <laughs> But at the end of it, it's all about the fun times and you always want to push your limits in order to bring us more no matter what you do, uh, we cronies will cherish it just as much as a remarkable memory and speaking of some Oreo topics, I have some destructive information about that like a war crime but I'll save it as a next super teaser, I guess Yo, why why are you leaving me hanging like that? But thank you for the rainbow super. And at last, thank you again for attending Anime Boston to do the meet and greet with us. I know words are hard to express. Uh, so rainbow may be a solution. Yeah, it's problem solved. And I'm shocked that you just pulled out your baby teeth by yourself. I mean, what the? <laughs> What are you- what? What's wrong with- it's normal! You don't want to go to the dentist for that! Uh, see you next stream. Uh, Semper Fidelis to you, crony. Thank you. What does that mean? Latin? Latin. Semper Fidelis. Ah. Thank you. And, uh, Gaslighting. Oh, that's actually pretty good. Uh, thank you to Red Comet. Would love to see you play the Mega Man X series. I hope it's short. But yeah. And uh, thank you to Gabriel Crony. Oh, traveled for two days and had barely any sleep, but Boston was fun. It was awesome watching your panel and meeting you face to face, Crony. Yeah, that was pretty funny. <laughs> the the entrance. Oh man, I, I'm not I'm not gonna you know say what happened, but. I- I had- I had a fun time. And Lamboid. And Casey Akisu, Butler of Time. Uh, thanks for a wonderful time at Anime Boston. Uh, I'm truly fortunate to have talked to you and glad we could talk about the cronies. Uh, they're a goofy lot, but they're family. Mm. Oh, I wish the cronies good luck. Hope there's a maid crony next meet and greet too. That would be awesome. And remember... Secret... Our secret? Yeah. We take that to the grave, buddy. And thank you to Mega Man XC. Talking about Mega Man, that's a super chat. <laughs> Thank you. And Sabas. Uh, as far as hobbies go, I want to get back into learning guitar in Ableton. Oh! <gasps> Music production? Or mixing? Uh, games. I've been playing uh, the Centennial Case. Something about a murder mystery. Spanning through time is really neat. Uh, have a good evening, Centennial Case. Oh, it's like an interactive story, I think. That seems cool. And thank you. <laughs> we aren't boomers, we're timeless. Okay, cope. And Corona. This is the case in point on why you shouldn't gaslight everyone around you and yourself. You've gaslighted yourself so much that you don't know what's real anymore. 
Or I don't know what the word gaslight is, really. Maybe that's that. Also, that Spark Mandrill stage theme slaps. Yeah. Mega Man music? Yeah, it's pretty amazing. And Jonas Renatza, thank you. Uh, ZX Emperoni, Crony's Penguin. Uh, fun fact, my name takes inspiration from Mega Man Zero and X. Oh! It's always interesting to hear uh, how people came up with their names. There's always a story behind it. Even though it may seem like there's... Like there's no story, there's no reason, there is. And that's cool. And to answer your question on games, I like... Uh, SRPGs, which I'm guessing... Strategic RPGs, JRPGs, and turn-based. Oh, So I guess uh, Fire Emblem checks all the boxes. By the way, have you seen the Counterside Gotcha? Counterside Gotcha? Counterside Gotcha? Huh. No, I've never... Never seen this. And, uh... Thank you for this stream. Thank you. And last but not least, Blackout31, thanks for the strain, Cronster. Hope you have a marvelous rest of the day. Thanks. 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 Ugh. Yeah. Of course, we have to end, end this stream. On a morbulous note, of course. God, God. But with that, Crony, no, let me send one. No, no, it's it's been a good time, everyone, and. You will see me tomorrow with, I think, Gorogoa. I think. Yes. So, see ya. See ya then. Because we'll have another great time tomorrow. Yeah. Bye, Croy, yes, to me.